Hello and welcome. How are you doing? Next, I like to show you that how I can check and inspect my cars, these chocks. And this is part of our suspension. And here I have brand new chock. There is no yet this spring in here. Spring is now away, but other parts in here they are ready. They are in here, and this is. This is like this uh, rare areas chalk and and there how we can then inspect this our new chalk and especially this old chalk because we are quite soon going to inspect our cars this chalk status and in this chalk chalk chalks there is only uh, this possibility faulty thing is that when this part, this metallic tube, it is full of this uh, this oil, oil and gas, that area. It, this oil, it is it is full on this area in here. There is oil and gas, and that's because it is high pressure metallic tube, and when this becomes old. We can see normally in that area in here, there is leak in here. And its leak is quite easy to notice when we look our old chalk and we only check that is there any oily leaks in here. And what is this oily leak? Okay, I like to show you. Because this is brand new chalk and we need in here oily leak and I have in here engine oil and oily leaks means that that there is some kind of that kind of things that oil is moving in here in that way and normally when this oil becomes old this area where this oil is going it is it is black and it is easy to see when it, there is black thing all other areas in this chalk they are normally dry but when we notice that there is some areas black and wet thing, like oily thing, then we can right away notice that, hey, now I have issue in my chalk and I need to then purchase new chalk, like in that one. And then, remember, if you have car, what name is like Toyota car, I recommend to purchase uh, original quality and actually original parts and this chip is here, this brand, this is company what makes in Japan this Toyota's original chocks. And Toyota actually owns that company also. And that's this quality is the best. Okay, but this was this information that how we can find these leaks. And there is now oily leak in here. We can see easily that there is oily leak. And we can't repair if there is oily leak because this is so complex and dangerous part to replace these gaskets and i can't do that and i don't recommend to do and that's we need to next to go look that where is in this my car where we can see these leaks okay and then we go to look my car okay and now when we are Looking and searching these oil leaks in this chock, chocks in this rear area and also in front area. It's good to start to look all of these chocks very carefully with light. An idea is that if we can see that this chock is dry like in that one. This is chock. Chock is okay. And there is no any leaks in here and no in any, any areas. This is fine. And that means that now this left area's chalk is okay. And then we go to look that right area. And in here we can right away say, look that this is not dry. This is a little bit like wet. And there is when I touch that, I can feel that it is a little bit oily. It is like oily and sand. And that's we can see that now in that chalk. We have issue and we need to replace that chalk. Look, there is no any dry dry things in that chalk. And this is like bad chalk. And let's compare that again, especially if we touch that. 
in this way, when I touch that in this way, we can see that there is this oily, oily sand what goes in this my tire and then we go to look in that area and he, in here when I touch that in here I can't get almost anything it is only dry this dry sand and when I insert that in this my field there is no anything this is dry look and that one this is oily this is easy to see and then when we go to see those other other chokes also we can see the same thing that this is dry in there that area this part in here there is no any oily things in there and it is cool and then we check also the second and it is also totally dry there is no any this area in here okay so now I have issue that I have one job what I need to replace immediately. Okay, that kind of information and have a nice day to you.